now to a new era for so South Florida soccer fans who weathered strong storms to officially welcome Lionel Messi to Inter Miami. Yeah, that was loyalty in action <laughs> yesterday. It will be a busy week ahead of his debut on the pitch in Local 10's Christian De La Rosa live now in Fort Lauderdale with Messi Mania tonight. Christian. Listen, tomorrow is going to be a huge day for so many fans who've been dreaming of this moment, seeing Messi hitting the field with his new inner Miami teammates. Tomorrow, it will be their first practice session ahead of their first match this Friday against Cruz Azul. And as we learn more about what's ahead for this team, we are learning that it is very likely this world champion won't be the only one carrying the weight of this struggling team. Messi, welcome to Miami. Messi, we love you. The greeting tour continues with a star-studded Miami welcome. Congratulations. Fit for a goat. Congratulations. Muchas gracias, muchas gracias. Buenas noches. Lionel Messi, now just hours away from hitting the field for his first practice with his new Inter-Miami team after being officially introduced Sunday night. The man believed to be the greatest of all time is joining a struggling team. Do you have any concerns about Messi having to carry this team on his shoulders? Uh, not really. Inter Miami fans say they're hopeful, not just for Messi, but other top notch players who could soon join the team, as teased in this seemingly foretelling three jersey picture recently tweeted by team managing owner Jorge Mas. I'm very really happy to be here. Also introduced Sunday, Messi's former club team, Sergio Busquets, has officially joined the team. And a third badly kept secret who fans believe will soon be signed on, Jordi Alba from FC Barcelona. So I think that alleviates some of the pressure that would be that would have been all on him. Uh, plus our youthful uh, talent that they're bringing up, uh, homegrown players, and I think it's going to be super successful. Friday's match is expected to be a sold out event, but there are still tickets available, some going from the few hundred bucks to the thousands and thousands of dollars. But fans that we've been talking to tell us price won't be an obstacle to see the man they describe as a living legend in action. Live in Fort Lauderdale, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News.